Hello, Gear fans, and welcome to another screencast from GearWire.com. My name is Dan. Check. Plosive. 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 So as you can see right there, I just recorded some of my vocals for seemingly no reason. But the actual reason is because we're going to listen to this and sort of do, using the uh, filters on this Neve 88RS, which comes, uh, which is a UAD uh, plugin runs on the UAD one card and is uh, one of the newer ones and uh, sort of do a telephone effect using the filters and maybe a little bit of EQ so uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and loop this and see what we can do yeah telephone effect is really a bandpass filter um, the telephone will only pass about 800 8,000 Hertz of uh, frequency range and bandwidth is eight eight thousand hertz when the actual hearing range of a healthy young child is more like uh, twenty thousand uh, hertz uh, cycles or whatever um, so let's uh, listen to this and make this into a uh, telephone type signal using these filters and by the way I do really like these filters they're very usable they don't sound weird they don't introduce much weird phase problems what they do introduce is usually pretty nice and i like to use it so let's uh, get moving on this i'm going to start hello with the gear low fans end. and welcome to another screencast from uh, gearwire.com my name is dan check plosive 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 hello Plo gear fans and J just a little uh, background a plosive sound is like a p uh, I've turned off, I, I usually record with a, uh, a low-pass filter, which I'm actually going to turn on right now. I'm sorry, it's a high-pass filter. This is what I usually record with, and so you don't get any of those weird plosives, but I turned it off for that, so that we could show that uh, a plosive, which is a P sound, you often get a P pop, and even though I do have a, uh, a windscreen on this microphone, sometimes it does get through, so we do need to apply uh, some... Uh, low filtering. Let, let's just kind of loop that section where I say plosive. Welcome to Siv. Plosive. Plosive. And plosive. Plosive. Pl what I'm going to try to do is just get rid of the P without affecting the rest of the voice. This is a good practice. Good to know. Something good to know. Plosive. 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 So right around there. But then again, we are just trying to get a telephone signal using the filters and we might have to use a little bit of eq they're not that crazy the filters aren't that uh insane but uh so basically we just turn the the high pass filter all the way uh up to three 315 hertz now let's uh, do the same with the cut filter or the high cut fans and welcome to another screencast from a gearwire.com so that My one doesn't actually Dan. go that low Hello. so what we're going to need to do is uh bring out some more of that treble and maybe even more of that bass so let's just go ahead and go nuts gear fans and welcome to another screencast from a gearwire.com my name is dan hello gear fans and welcome to another screencast Sometimes in a telephone effect, there's also some strange res resonances that you wouldn't notice. And how to do that would be like uh, some uh, high Q. So we turned up, we turned down the bandwidth effectively, but made the Q uh, smaller. Com. My name is Dan. Hello, gear fans, and maybe folks. find a, a, an annoying little uh, frequency in there. Come to another screencast. From uh, GearWire.com, my and name is Dan. Of more of that Hello, trouble. Fans, and welcome to another screencast. Try to find another GearWire.com, my name is Dan. Hello, Gear fans, and welcome to another screencast. So I found another resonance in there, and I'm going to take out even more of the bass because there's just too much of it. From uh, GearWire.com, my name is Dan. Hello, Gear fans. Well. As, f as long as we're doing it, another uh, thing that happens to a voice when going over telephone is it gets very compressed. So let's just go crazy with the compressor as well. And welcome to another screencast from uh, GearWire.com. My name is Dan. Hello, Gear fans, and welcome to another screencast from uh, GearWire.com. Turn up the overall volume. 
Hello, Gear fans, and welcome to another screencast. Now, maybe you'd want to add a little bit of distortion to that, but that is pretty close to what you would find on a lot of EQs and or channel strips to simulate a telephone effect. I hope this was informative for you. Um, make sure to check out this Neve plugin if you if you are able, because it's pretty sweet. All right, bye.